Hi programmers, today we're going to start working on our adjust hours uh, tab so that we can, can edit from the grid line instead of from a box at the bottom and uh, this will be a short video and we're just sort of getting ready and then we'll start on uh, all the real hard work next time. Um, anyway, the first thing I did, I noticed that when we went and added records, it did not refresh for us. And so there was this line so called get seg, get hours and segs that we had on delete. And what that does is just refresh the grid line. And so we, I added that line to my add section right before we quit right there. And then the next thing we do is we go to the just hours and I have scrunched everything around so that I can make this uh, grid box bigger and uh, eventually we're going to delete out this one uh, this grid box but I want to keep it from now so I can see what's going on and the first thing we did when we was here is we have to make it read only false and it may already be false so make it read only false and then the next thing because I did not like that column uh oh. I did not like that column that was at this right side here. Uh, we want to make road headers visible equals false. And then we want to go back up here in the code. And um, on these columns that we're going to let them uh, update, like a SEG ID, they cannot update that because um, that's the key. But we're going to make this one like. Uh, Read only false. Let's see, yes. And end of time. Um, uh, I'm going to make that one false, and we're going to add two fields, but not today, because that's going to be a little bit of work, and I got to figure out the best way to do that. Okay, so we'll say date. They can edit that, um, which is when completed. They can edit that. Okay, that's uh, all we're going to do today on this. We are going to add two more columns, and then we have to do some kind of complex editing on the inside. So right now they're just editable, but it will not actually change the database. So let's see how this looks. So, so it will let us edit now. It won't let us edit the seg, but and this will not change the database because we have it. We've got to do that code behind. Okay. Well, that's all we're going to do today. Y'all go ahead and get that started, and we'll start working on the hard work.